All right, folks, it's May 23rd of 2013. Uh, it's almost 5.30 in the evening here. Uh, I'm in uh, near St. Petersburg, Florida right now, in between St. Pete and Seminole. What you're looking at right here is the Courtney at Bay Pines Luxury Apartment Homes. I don't know what year it was. I think it was somewhere between 2006 and 2008. What you're looking at here once was a trailer park for veterans. They have the uh, Veterans Administration right across the street over yonder way, uh, a couple hundred yards that way. They uh, came in here, wiped out all the mobile homes, told the people that they, uh, the land was no longer suitable for, for people living out anymore. Then they, uh, we we're going to come here and build some condos, did some core sampling. They said that uh, the land was not uh, stable enough to build on, so the place sat here for about three years, four years, empty. The mobile homes were sold for anywhere from 50 bucks to $200 a piece. Uh, I came in there and did a lot of scrap metal and stuff. A lot of people were giving me scrap metal left and right. Uh, carports and awnings and all kinds of stuff. Well, what we have here is uh, condos and apartments for the rich. What do you know about that, huh? They take away from the veterans all the time. They don't give back to them. Construction financing by Northwestern Mutual Real Estate Investments. Had to research that. Uh, Courtney at Bay Pond is now open, now leasing. Uh, if you look right over here, this is a Walmart. We've got a Walmart already, uh, probably about a mile or so, maybe a mile less from here, down here at Tywin Boulevard and Park Street. So I don't know what they're going to do with the old one. But, uh, yeah, this is what we got. We come up with here. This lake was never here before. This is all land right here. They did have a couple more lakes on the inside of the trailer park. They had alligators and all kinds of natural wildlife out there. Man, there were big old uh, oak trees and all kinds of beautiful land right here. And they took it all away just to build this monstrosity. Personally, myself, I don't care for it. Yeah, it's homes for thousands of more rich people. I don't understand it. Look across the street over here. That's part of Bay Pines over there. I don't know if these apartments over here are being built for the uh, veterans or not, but that's all government land over there. Uh, right over here, on the other side of the air state right here, well, actually, it's more right here. They have a little place called Hurricane Bay, and that's where people take old abandoned boats and knock holes in the bottom of them and just let them sink. And once they're over, often the uh, oh, look at the turtle. See the turtle over here? It's like make him go in the water. There he goes. He went in the water. All right. Okay, so we still do have a little bit of natural wildlife. There's that turtle sitting right there on top of the water, right there. Oh, he went back under. All right. Well, that's my rant for the moment. Well, I'm going to go ahead and keep on walking down here. You guys can see the face of Walmart and this big old strip mall, how corporate America is really taking over corporate America. Keeping the real people down and keeping the rich people up. That's the way I see it, and that's the way millions of other people see it, but I don't know. Look at him. Wish I had a zoom on this video. I'll certainly zoom in on it if I could. I'll try to see the good and everything. This lake right here, this is Abbey Lake. This is a retention pond for flooding. This lake here floods and the water will go over there. 
Uh, this would be all street runoff in both of these lakes. These are both actual retention ponds. They've repaved this road, they've relined it and everything since I've been gone. Here. And you can see more of these sidewalks weren't here before. There's even filling sidewalks for the veterans when they did live on this property here. <sighs> anyway, I've been having a good day today. It's about 97 degrees out for the high today right now. It's probably in the upper 80s, lower 90s right now. Humidity's way up. I've walked for miles and miles and miles today. I probably walked probably a good six or seven miles I walked today. Stop in at little restaurants and cafes along my way. Get myself a little bottles of water from little uh Ooh, what's that? Is that anything important? Is that anything important? Nah. It's empty. Well they maybe I might be a weed bag. That would be all right. Uh, right here on the corner, right over there, was a uh, fruit and vegetable stand for many a year. They came in there and shut that place down, tore it down. I don't know what's going on with these big old cranes over here. You guys still with me? Nod your head if you are. <laughs> be interesting to find out how many people actually nod their head. <laughs> uh, thinking about your pop tumble cone. Oh, look at the ducks. <laughs> thinking about your pop tumble cone. Missing you, liking all my videos and watching my videos, my friend. There, now you can see. What it looks like on the front side. Yeah, well, I guess uh, all good things must come to an end, and sometimes bad things gotta step in. Oh, look at this old wine glass. Wow, that sucker is old. Alright, I may just pick that up and take that with me. Look at this. Stick this in this glass. Back in the face by my bedroll. Look at the size of the sucker. Look at the thickness on this glass right here. Wow. Look at that stem. That's incredible. I'm not taking it with me, but it's just interesting. It'd be nice if it was still all one piece, right? Uh, I'm not going to take it with me. Oh, nice. It sticks. Well, all right, guys. I'm going to quit this rant right now and, uh, let y'all go so y'all can do your things. What you got to do. Thanks for watching my videos and be talking to you soon. Peace.